Hi, I'm Dr. Margaret Collins-Hill with Consults in Hypertension in Wilmington, North Carolina. The question this evening is how to get rid of broken blood vessels. The blood vessels we're talking about are veins, which are the vessels that carry blood back from the tissues to the heart. Veins are found throughout the body, but the ones that are the most visible are in the legs. Broken veins are smaller vessels, whereas varicose veins are larger than they, and they can be quite twisted and can be quite painful. People generally dislike having varicose veins and broken veins because of the way they look, but they also can be quite uncomfortable and can cause bleeding in certain circumstances. That's what brings you to the doctor. It's very important to know why you have the broken vessels or varicose veins. There are deeper veins that carry blood back to the heart, and their job is quite literally an uphill battle. They have to use the squeezing of the muscles of the legs and one-way valves to keep blood moving against gravity back to the heart. If any of those mechanisms fail, then you get a pooling of blood in the feet, and that causes swelling and a distension or swelling up of the veins, which leads to high pressure on the walls. That causes the vessels to enlarge and to break. If you have a problem with your deep, large veins, that has to be addressed. If you simply have broken veins or varicose veins on the surface, there are several therapies that can be used to make them better. In some instances, all you need to do is to wear compression hose or to elevate your legs periodically because that reduces the pressure in the veins. If that doesn't work, there are several ways you can get rid of the veins by injecting chemicals that will cause the vessel to close and scar or with lasers. In more serious situations, you may need to have surgery where the surgeon will tie off the vein. So, when you go to your doctor with broken veins or varicose veins, be certain that there's not a deeper problem. If there isn't, there's several ways that you can get a good result in the way things look and feel. So, to recap, See your doctor. This is Dr. Margaret Collins-Hill about how to get rid of broken blood vessels.